Garcia. Off the deflection, Los Fresnos comes back and wins. Santa Maria will put up a three. All righty, welcome back here to our broadcast on Real Sports Live's coverage of the 2021 Brahma Classic, fourth installment here on Real Sports Live. Battle of the Mustangs here, the Corpus Christi King Mustangs set to take on the Laredo Nixon Mustangs. This game on Real Sports Live via Facebook, Twitter, YouTube, and Roku TV. Once again, Ruben Rodriguez on the call, joined by Rudy Zamaripa now manning the camera. Once again, the Battle of the Mustangs, the King Mustangs set to take on the Nixon Mustangs. Nixon knocking off. Corpus Christi veterans, 76-49. Veterans, the team that defeated Corpus Christi King, 68-38. Tip off in a minute and 45 seconds on Real Sports Live. It's the Mustangs versus the Mustangs, and it's on Real Sports Live. Organized and priced for you. Forever Memories, 237 North Sam Houston, San Benito. We are La Villa, and you're watching Real Sports Live. Whether you're visiting or vacationing at South Padre Island, be sure to book your place to stay with Island Services. Locally owned for over 40 years. Trusted, reliable. For condo and beach house rentals, call and visit the website today. Island Services. We are Lauren Carlos and you're watching Real Sports Live. Hi, I'm Roto Vegas and I'm a partner with New York Life Insurance Company. For 170 years, New York Life has built a reputation for building some of the finest agents in the industry. I help to manage that process from day one. If you're looking to challenge yourself and build an insurance and financial service business, then I would like to show you how I can help. Memories, Antiques and Collectibles, located at 237 North Sam Houston in San Benito, is filled with vintage items, collectibles, and a selection of vinyl records that's as good as it gets. Every shelf, every aisle, and table is filled daily by a number of vendors that ensures that something here just might be the item. Welcome back to Real Sports Live here. Corpus Christi Kings said to take on the radio next team. The King of Mustangs led by head coach Evan Hartlob. Nixon Mustangs led by head coach Pete Salise Jr., King, the home team, in the home whites with the green trim. Nixon in the road green with yellow and white trim. Nixon going from left to right. And now the court needed to be fixed up. They say teamwork makes the dream work. They're getting it wrapped up there. They got it to go through here, so now a little delayed start, but now we're seconds away from starting off. One of the loops in the net came loose here, so tip off for just a few seconds away here on Real Sports Live. Once again, King going from right to left, Nixon vice versa. Tip off and wonder away, and it's gonna be won by King. On the drive back, taking that one, it's going to be Cervantes. Feeds the pass across to Palmer. Terrell Palmer looking to go around, swings it outwards. And nobody home on that pass. As the Nixon defense forcing a miscue eventually as they get the inbound to Anaya in reaction. Luis Anaya gets it back over to Adrian Medellin, who finished off the game with 15 points against Corpus Christi Vets. To feed the pass to Tobar. Tobar goes to Gilbert Bada. Bada who goes back over to Medellin, who goes back to Bada. Bada with the three. Shot won't go. Won't be surprised if we see Bada take more threes. He put up 24 points, all of them coming from way beyond the three-point line. Was our RSL player of the game presented by Luke Freer Motors. 
looking to drive through here. John Michael Johnson tacks on two. As Nixon strikes first, looking to put that one up. Or King looks to strike first. Astobad with the response. And now we're tied up here with 7.07 left to play in the first. On the steal there, Medellin. Medellin swings it back out over this time to Richard Garcia, who gets it over. Swings it across. Stolada puts it up and gets it through. Four points already for Ian Tolad. Has the drive back. Looking to take that one through is Palmer. That one broken up. Anaya driving this one back, taking his time with it. Swings it outwards now, finds Medellin. Medellin looking to cut through traffic, finds a wide open Bada on the corner, puts it through. And Gilbert Bada picking up right where he left off. Three points on the day to start off his campaign. Remember, he had nothing but three-pointers in that game against Corpus Christi Veterans Memorial. And the travel going to be called. Nixon Mustang basketball. Adrian Medellin again, 15 points in that game against Corpus Christi Veterans. That was a team that knocked off Corpus Christi King in our second game today. From day one of the Brahma Classic. Looking to put this one up. Wide open. Bada again from the corner. Puts it through. Bada already. Six points on today. And a steal here as they're driving this one back. Swings it across. Finds a wide open. Johnson who puts it off the glass. Won't go. The lot on the rebound. Looking to go on the move. Swings it outwards. Putting it up and gets it through. Six points for Ian Tobad. 12-2, and just like that, Nixon up to a 10-point lead as Cervantes swings this one across. That one gets past Levas, who goes back over to Cano, who goes back to Terrell Palmer. Terrell Palmer goes back over to Cano, hits a three, won't go. On the rebound, getting that one was Bada. That's Medellin driving this one back. Medellin swings it off to Garcia. Garcia goes to Tobad. Tobad. Goes back over to Bada, who gets it back to Anaya. Luis Anaya goes back to Bada. Bada, another three. Now one off the back of the rim. Tobad on the rebound. Gets it back out. Bada tries it again. And falls short. King basketball, 12 to two. Bada and, and Tobad both with six points apiece. All of the lot of six points coming from twos. All of Bada six points coming from threes. Looking to drive this one up, won't go. On the rebound, Medellin. Medellin driving this one back now for the Nixon Mustangs. Going on the move. Swings it back out. Goes in the corner, putting that one on the shot attempt was Leza. Have a check in coming in under Coleman. Checks into the ball game. Drive this one back, going on the move. Palmer swings this one across over to Cervantes. Cervantes goes to Coleman, who gets this one across to Cano, who goes through instead of shooting. Now one knocked out of his hands. King basketball. Long inbound across, gets it off to Palmer. Terrell Palmer looking to go around. Swings it across, gets it over to Cano. Deep corner three, that one off the mark. On the rebound, Cervantes. Swings this out, we're looking to pull the trigger. Johnson, and that, that one kisses around the rim. Coleman on the rebound. Hunter Coleman gets this one off. Now Cervantes who gives another crack from the three point line, won't go. On the rebound, Medellin. Adrian Medellin driving this one back. Swings it back out over to Salazar. Sar, who now has the pass off over to Leza. That one's stolen away. On the drive back here, Escano going on the move. Gano swings this one out, but broken up. And it's broken up by Nixon King basketball. 3.51 left to play in the first. Nixon again coming out swinging, holding on to a 10 point lead, but they've been held at a 10 point lead. Long three, puts it through. Lead cut down to seven off a long range three by Terrell Palmer. 
Makes it 5 to 12. Makes him still up by 7. They get the pass across to Leza. Leza goes over now to Salazar. Salazar decides to go back instead to Alonso. Alonso gets it off over to Medellin. Who goes off to Leza. It was caught in traffic by a lot of defense by John Michael Johnson. A lot of pressure. Aspada trying to shake off multiple defenders. Gets it across to Salazar, who swings it out over to Escobar. Escobar going to cut through a lane, won't go. Johnson on the rebound. Johnson now driving back for the King Mustangs, going on the move. Now we're seeing a press here against Johnson. He's going to cut through, swings it across over to Calderon, who pulls it from the three. That one off the mark, won't go. Coleman on the rebound. Picked up here now by Medellin, who's driving this one back. Medellin trying to shake off with a step back three. That one's short. On the rebound, Cervantes. Cervantes driving this one back, finds Calderon. Calderon gets it back across, finds Johnson. Who goes to Coleman, who gets it off. To Palmer from the three and puts it through. Terrell Palmer, six points on today. And cuts it down to a four point game, 12 to eight now. Medellin gets it across to Alonso, who goes over to Leza. It goes back to Salazar. Salazar trying to shake off the defense here of Cervantes. Goes and sit off to Medellin. In goes to Lezo. Goes back to Medellin who swings this one out to Escobar. Is looking to pull the trigger. But Palmer with quick defense contesting him. Feed the pass back across to Alonso. Gets it over to Diego Salazar. Long three by Alonso. Puts it through. Alonzo waiting by less and Alonzo tacks on to three. We're gonna drive this one back. Johnson swings it out to Palmer for three straight threes. Won't go. 14 to eight. 15 to eight, excuse me. Broken up. Five three-pointers already hit. Three by Nixon. Two by King. 37 left to play to get the inbound off to Cervantes. is being pressed now. Cervantes gets it across to Terrell Palmer. Hit two back-to-back -back threes. Palmer on the move. Palmer fouled. And foul number two goes against Nixon. As Palmer was driving back a force out. Cervantes set to inbound. Gets it across to Calderon. That one knocked onto the scorer's table. Winds up out of bounds. Again, King basketball. Cervantes goes to Calderon again. Who gets it across to Johnson. Johnson was intending to get the pass off to Palmer. That one picked off. Has a wide open Garcia. Takes it through and a foul and one. Garcia tacks on two, and that's foul number one. The King Mustangs will see in the first half. This sends Richard Garcia to the free point line. Seventeen to eight, nine point lead, a chance to make it a ten point ball game. As Garcia takes his first trip to the charity stripe, puts it through. Three point play complete. 10 point lead, 110 left to play. Putting that one up, won't go. Coleman on the rebound. Coleman trapped here. Has that one stolen away? Ball knocked loose, gets it off to Medellin, but it's stolen off by Malachi Calderon. He gets it across over to Cervantes. Cervantes swings it out, looking to put this one up. And knocks out of bounds. Foul number three here by Nixon. One foul against King. Sends Palmer to the line. Terrell Palmer, six points on the day, takes his first trip to the free throw line. He sinks the first one. Seven points on the day for Palmer. King cuts the lead down to nine. A few bounces, and he goes two for two from the free throw line. Driving this one back, and now he takes a long pass here. We're seeing passing around the perimeter now by the Nixon Mustangs. Goes back over to Pada. Gets it back across over to Salazar. Salazar goes with the lot. 
Gets it back over to Bada. Pulls a contested shot. That one's short. Anaya on the rebound. Goes over to Thawada. Pulls a short range two. That one won't fall. Anaya with back-to-back -back rebounds. Goes over to Garcia, who goes to Salazar. Goes to Bada, who goes to Thawada. We go to pass back over to Garcia, and he goes back to Salazar. Salazar trying to shake him off. Goes off to Bada, who gets this one off to Garcia. Who goes back over. Bada looking to take a shot. Makes a nice pass to the Lod. He swings this one over to Anaya. Gets it over. Bada goes back to Anaya. Anaya swings this one through to Garcia in the corner. Shot would have been good if it counted. Would have counted if it was good. 18 to 10, your current score. You're going to step away for a few moments. Second quarter after this, you're watching Real Sports Live. Ready. Brownsville Independent School District, the best choice. And he throws it down. Hey! See you later, touchdown. I love what I do. I, I really do. I love what do. I'm doing. I love children. One of the most important things to do is to love your students. Imagine teachers like these helping your child prepare to change the world. Take a closer look at Mission CISD. when excellence in academics meets discovery on the court. Matt to Real Sports Live start of the second quarter, 18 to 10. Nixon leading King. Give you the rundown here for Nixon, Alonso and Garcia finished off with three apiece. Bada and Tobad with six apiece. It's a drive through by Tobad on go. Palmer on the rebound. Palmer finished off with eight points in the first quarter. John Michael Johnson with two. Michael Johnson driving this one across. Now a two-on-one press we're seeing. He swings it across. And a timeout going to be called by Corvus Christie King. 7.35 left to play in the first half. Nixon leads by eight. You're watching Real Sports Live. It will help our students acquire the necessary knowledge, communication, and problem-solving skills through a variety of educational and social experiences to become productive citizens in our global society. Be a part of the change to help create a community where we guide each other to our unlimited potential. We are Santa Rosa and you're watching Real Sports Live. There is a feeling you get when you walk onto a campus. A sense of love, compassion. Welcome back to Real Sports Live's cover to the, 20, uh, the 2021 Brahma Classic presented by Big House Burgers here on 2209 Brahma Boulevard in Kingsville, Texas as they're back underway. Feeling hungry? Go by after the game. Grab yourself some burgers, barbecue, sandwiches, and wings, and a few adult beverages. Also catering for your special events. Again, Big House Burgers here on Brahma Boulevard in Kingsville, Texas. We bring you back to the action here from the Brahma Classic. H&M King High School in Kingsville, Texas. Looking to drive this one. Gets it across. The line swings it out over to Medellin, who gets it off to Anaya. Anaya goes back over. Nice move there by Tovada to put it through. And he cuts through the open lane. Eight points as Ian Tholad strikes first for the Nixon Mustangs in the second quarter as Garcia tried to get himself a piece of the action. Having a tie up. And a tie up here. Inbound here set now by John Michael Johnson. Gets it off from back to action, finds Troy Gano. Swings it across now to Terrell Palmer. Terrell Palmer gets it back over to Calderon. Ball comes loose, winds up out of bounds. King Mustang basketball. Gabriel Cervantes set to inbound. Long inbound across, finds Gano, who gets it off to Johnson. Johnson now being pressed heavily. Johnson looking to call his own number, swings it out over Cervantes from the three. In and out of the rim. Johnson on the rebound, going to call his own number himself and puts it through as that one takes a few bounces before it drops. That's four points now for John Michael Johnson. Lisa Naya swings it across. 
to pass off to Garcia. Goes to Medellin. It goes with the lot. The lot, eight points on the day. Goes to Bada. It goes off now to Garcia. Richard Garcia looking to drive. Finds the lot, but that one comes loose. Malachi Calderon driving it back, and a foul going to be drawn. All right, Jim One, we have another good matchup for you. Corpus Christi Race is taking on Corpus Christi Miller. That one currently going on. Joe Gomez having the call with that one over at Gym 1. It's bound number four against Nixon. One against King so far in this first half. Eight point lead continuing here as they get the inbound off to John Michael Johnson. Johnson swings it across and finds Cervantes. Cervantes swings this across to Cano. Cano from downtown in the corner puts it through. Wide open take for a three by Cano. Tacks on his first three of the day. His first bucket of the day. Looking to drive that one through is Escobar. He's being pressured heavily by Cano. Foul called. Offensive foul here against King. Against Nixon, excuse me. It's foul number five to commit. Passing here. Escana looks to take this one back. Gets it over. Johnson goes over to Gano. Gano for back-to-back -back threes. Puts it through. And now lead cut down to two. That's Troy Gano with back-to-back -back threes. Gano with the steal. Gano now going to lay this one up over for Palmer. Who's trying to oop it to him. Bobad gets it off over. Bada with the response, that one's short. Escobar on the rebound, trying to put that one back. Alden on with the block. Bada going for the three, Escobar comes up with the rebound and Malachi Alden on coming in out of nowhere to prevent a shot. As we'll get to the replay in a few seconds. Gonna pull the trigger here, Espada, that one falling short. Escobar, excuse me, that one falls short, winds up out of bounds. Let's take a look at the replay presented by South Padre Island. Find your trip at SoPadre.com as some check-ins here now coming in for the Nixon Mustangs. So they try to do a bit, Bada going for the shot. Missed, Escobar coming in for the rebound, and Malachi Calderon coming in for the block. As the King Mustangs here now down by two after two consecutive threes hit by Troy Gano. Palmer swings it across to non-coming Johnson, who's fouled and won. And we are tied here as John Michael Johnson now with six points on the day, drives through and fouled on his way to the basket, sinks it through, and we have a tie ball game and a chance to take the lead as King as a whole, two for two from the free throw line. We had Terrell Palmer tack on two in the first quarter, and they go three for three as King takes the lead for the first time in this one. 21-20, King leading Nixon now. A shocking turn of events. Medellin gets the inbound across. Who found Alonso goes back to Medellin, who swings his out to Garcia. Garcia goes back to Medellin, who goes to Salazar, who goes off over now to Leza. Medellin and Salazar going for a shot. A foul called. Down number two against King. Inbound off and resume play. That's Salazar driving it. Salazar was trying to drive through another foul being drawn. Two back to back fouls against King. Six fouls against Nixon here in the second half. First half, three against King. Non shooting fouls to get inbound from the baseline. Gets it off to Alonso, who puts it through. Nixon back on top by one. 427 left to play. Driving this one back and a foul drawn again. Foul number seven against Nixon. As that puts King in the bonus and it's in Cervantes to the free throw line. Chance to take the, to tie the game up. Redding checks out of the ball game. Luis Anaya checks back in. One and one attempt here. 
Cervantes nets it through. We have a tie ball game. Two shot attempt. King four for four from the charity stripe today. We had Palmer go two for two. John Michael Johnson on the and one and Cervantes here. As they go four for five. Salazar gets the ball back, ball back to a nine, excuse me. Swings it over. Going for a three is alone, so that one falls short and kept in play by Salazar, falling into the hands of Calderon. Calderon on the move. It's called. Now check ins here. Astolvad and Bada check back into the ball game for the Nixon Mustangs. Tie game here, 22 22. We're off. Salazar. Gets that one across to Garcia. Garcia looking to maneuver around. Gets it to do to the lot. of swings it outwards here to Anaya. Anaya goes back over to Bada. Bada, six points scoreless in the second quarter so far. Passing around the perimeter here by the Nixon Mustangs. Gets it across, taking to go on the move. Salazar swings it over to Anaya. Anaya looking to spread the court offensively, swings it across to Bada, who moves around over. Garcia goes back to Bada, pulls the trigger from downtown. A few bounces before it finally falls through. Nixon retakes the lead off a of three by Gilbert Bada. That's nine points on the day again, just like the first game. He has not shot a single shot from within the three-point line. As Coleman with the ball gets it across over to Terrell Palmer. Palmer swings this one out over Cervantes. It goes to Gano. Gano looking to drive through, swings it back out. Palmer gets it. He goes over to Coleman. Coleman takes a long three. That one off the back of the rim won't go on the rebound. Bada gets it off to Anaya. Anaya swings it over to Salazar, who goes back across to Garcia. Gets it back over to Salazar. It goes back over to Bada. Bada, nine points on the day. It goes to Anaya. Anaya scoreless. Throws the Bada for 12. Puts it through. Nixon now coming out to a six point lead. 12 points here now for Gilbert Bada. A Baker's dozen driving this one back. Goes over. Finds Gano. Gano shot blocked. Loose ball falls in the hands of Tobad. Tobad on the move. Looking to swing that one out to Garcia, maintains control. He's trapped in the corner on a two-on-one press and a steal there by Calderon. Goes in the hands of Gano. Gano looking to drive. Gano makes a nice move. That one falls short here. Looks like there was interference. Palmer comes up with the ball, goes for a mid-range jumper, won't go. Tobad on the rebound. Gets it across to Garcia, who now goes over to Salazar. Salazar going on the move, swings this one across now, finds Bada, who goes to Anaya who swings it back down. Miscue on the offense, broken up by Palmer, but finally falling into the hands of Anaya, so that allows a reset. And Coach Solis is gonna call a timeout here. Nixon holding on to a six point lead, 28-22 off back-to-back -back threes by Gilbert Bada to retake the lead for Nixon. 146 off the play in the first half, you're watching Real Sports Live. CISD. We are Eddie Bergbella and you're watching Real Sports Live. Sherryland ISD, a nationally recognized district focusing on quality and rigorous instruction where every child is immersed in a culture of academic success. A district dedicated to preparing our youth for the future. Our mission is to inspire, educate, and empower all students to reach their full potential and become leaders of the highest moral character. Sherryland ISD, excellence is our tradition. and you're watching Real Sports Live. Uniforms, etc. you're gonna find the opportunity to purchase the best high quality scrubs. Soon after I learned about how the EDC was helping out uh, the community, and so I did meet with uh, Ms. Castillo. She made it very easy, very friendly, and she walked me every step of That's a Real Sports Live, 28-22, 146 Go left to play. At the inbound back off, we're back underway. Trying to get this one up, won't go. That one winds up out of bounds. Gets it across here, Palmer going on the move. A foul called.
Eight fouls now against Nixon. Three against King here, 28-22. 141 left to play in this one. As that sends Palmer to the line. Palmer scoreless in the second quarter. He tacked on eight points in the first, two threes, and went two for two from the charity stripe. He'll go three for three. Nine points on the day now for Terrell Palmer. Cuts the lead down to five. A chance to make it a four-point ball game. Two-shot attempt for Terrell Palmer. Again, Palmer three for three from the charity stripe today. Puts it through, goes four for four. You can call that a Wendy's order. 28-24. And Aya swings this pass across, gets it over. Tovada makes a nice cut. We've been seeing Tovada make all these cuts throughout the day. We saw it against veterans, and we're seeing it against King now here. As Laredo Nixon looks to go 2-0 against Corpus teams here in this tournament so far. Ten points on a day for Ian Tovad. Johnson looking to maneuver around. Johnson cutting through traffic. Swings it out over to Gano from the three-point line. That one over shot kept in play by Salazar. Salazar goes to Anaya. Anaya going on the move. Swings it across now back to Salazar. Diego Salazar swings it over to Gilbert Bada. Bada, 12 points on today. Goes back to Anaya. Goes back to Bada for 15. Puts it through. Fifteen points on today for Gilbert Bada. He's tacked on nine so far in the second quarter. Palmer swings it off to Coleman. Coleman swings it out over to Gano. Gano from downtown. Down off the back of the rim. Won't go on the rebound. Escobar. Escobar gets it across now to Salazar. Salazar going on the move. Swings it over to Anaya. Anaya gets this one back across to Bada. It goes back over to Anaya. Gets it back over to Bada. Bada 15 points on the day. Tacked on six. In the first quarter, nine in the second is a nine and Bada going back to fourth. Back and forth as that one was broken up by Johnson, who was reading the play well. We are seeing a lot of back and forth passing between Anaya and Bada in that little sequence. As he goes with Ovada, goes to Bada, Bada for 18. That one won't go. On the rebound, Lascano. Now takes us to the end of the first half, 24 33. Very back and forth matchup falling into the hands of Nixon so far off some clutch shooting by Gilbert Bada and Ian Tobad. 33-24, nine point lead at the half. You're watching Real Sports Live halftime recap after this. The item you have to have. The vital record area helps bring an added atmosphere that makes for the fun trip when stepping back in time with the memories. Forever memories, antiques and collectibles in San Benito. When excellence in academics meets discovery on the court, in the arts, with institutions of higher education and beyond, we are the future leaders and our success starts now. La Via ISD, Cardinal Pride. Service is attitude. How far are we willing to go to service our community, our dealership here at Fruya, and you? Sky's the limit. Plan your escape. Beach, bay, or both. Sun rises and sun sets daily. Memories made all day. Live music and great food round out your visit. So why wait? Sopadre.com Motors, we're moving forward. Same great service, same great people, same great cars and trucks, and these great white events. Our vision is crystal clear. Look for your motors. We're on the move. Welcome back to Real Sports Live at the half, 
Nixon leading Corpus Christi King here. Again, I'd like to welcome you now to the Real Sports Live Halftime Show. Ruben Rodriguez on the call. Rudy Zamari by mining the camera. Let's start off as a back and forth battle heavily controlled by Nixon. King has worked their way through. We had a tie ball game for multiple occasions so far in the second quarter. But Nixon coming into play, especially Gilbert Bada, 15 points. Again, continuing his dominant run he had in that game against Corpus Christi Veterans Memorial, who's our player of the game in that one. And again, he's not shot a shot from within the three-point line all tournament long so far. As Bada with 15 points. Let's give you the foul countdown. King finished off the first half with three fouls. Nixon with eight. Scoring for King. Troy Gano with six. Terrell Palmer leads the scoring with 10. John Michael Johnson with seven. Gabriel Cervantes with one over for Nixon. Alexi Alonso with five. Richard Garcia with three. Gilbert Bada with 15. Ian Tobada with 10. Again, expect a close state matchup for the rest of the ball game here. Both teams back and forth. We know King has the firepower to do so. We saw Troy Gano hit back-to-back -back threes to tie the ball game and take the lead. Then an and one call he draw. That was John Michael Johnson who drew, drove through and got fouled, which gave the tying game. Tying point, excuse me, 33-24 here. 4.22 left to play now after watching Real Sports Live. When excellence in academics meets discovery on the court, in the arts, with institutions of higher education and beyond. We are the future leaders and our success starts now. La Via ISD, Cardinal Pride. We're the Ray Texans and you're watching Real Sports Live. Josh Moody and Coach Rolly Gonzalez of Josh Moody Loans are former Harlingen Cardinals and would like to wish all the teams good luck in tonight's games. We envision that San Perlita ISD will help our students acquire the necessary knowledge, communication, and problem-solving skills through a variety of educational and social experiences to become productive citizens in our global society. Be a part of the change to help create a community where we guide each other to our unlimited potential. We are Santa Rosa and you're watching Real Sports Live. There is a feeling you get when you walk onto a campus. A sense of love, compassion, and dedication. An environment that inspires each of our HCISD family members to do their best and to be their best. We ground our education on strong character, and together, we will always persist towards the future. We are a district of choice. A district of innovation. And a district of excellence. We are HCISD. We are Eddie Bergbella and you're watching Real Sports Live. Sherryland ISD, a nationally recognized district focusing on quality and rigorous instruction where every child is immersed in a culture of academic success. A district dedicated to preparing our youth for the future. Our mission is to inspire, educate, and empower all students to reach their full potential and become leaders of the highest moral character. Sherryland ISD, excellence is our tradition. We are La Villa and you're watching Real Sports Live. Uniforms, et cetera, you're gonna find the opportunity to purchase the best high quality scrubs. Soon after I learned about how the EDC was helping out uh, the community, and so I did meet with uh, Ms. Castillo. She made it very easy, very friendly, and she walked me every step of the way. I couldn't have done it without their help. Come visit our new store in downtown Harlingen. We have furniture, appliances, clothes, collectibles, and more. All funds collected support the Sunny Glen Children's Home. Come see us at Vintage on Jackson, at first in Jackson and Harlingen. I love what I do. I, I really love what do. I'm doing. I love children. One of the most important things to do is to love your students. Imagine teachers like these helping your child prepare to change the world. Take a closer look at Mission CISD.
This game is brought to you in part by the concession stand in Santa Rosa, a locally owned business providing a terrific atmosphere before or after the games and supporting athletes of all ages. When you're in Santa Rosa, be sure to stop by the concession stand and choose from the wide assortment of goodies. An advertising partner with Rio Sports Live is the concession stand. Music lovers, you have to stop and see the assortment of records, tapes, and records memorabilia at Forever Memories today. Located at 237 North Sam Houston in San Benito, Texas, there's over 10,000 records on display and more coming every day. Looking for your favorite album from the past? First pressings. Welcome back to the third, port third quarter here coming to you from the Brahma Classic on Real Sports Live. Fourth installment coming to you from H&M King High School in Kingsville, Texas. Ruben Rodriguez on the call. Rudy Zamadiba manning the camera. Nixon here leading by 9, 33, 24 at the start of the third quarter. Story of the day so far, Gilbert Bada again, 15 points, is not taking a single shot from within the three-point line. So we're back underway. That's Medellin with the ball. Adrian Medellin gets the pass across to Ian Tovar. Tovar with 10 points on today. Gets it across, looking to go on the move. Bada gets the pass to Tovar. Tovar swings it over to Medellin, who gets it over to Garcia. Richard Garcia finishing off the first half with three points. Bovad goes over to Anaya. Anaya gets this one across over to Bada. Bada goes over to Anaya, who swings it out over to Garcia in the corner, who's met quickly by Gano. Bovad looking to drive through, puts it up, and a block here by Palmer. Still falling into the hands of the Nixon Mustangs. That's Menein. Menein being pressured heavily here now by Levas. Looking to go on the move. Makes multiple defenders miss. He fakes them out, won't go. Trying to put that one up. Kept in play as Anaya gets the rebound. Who goes over to Menein, who goes to Salazar. Or who goes from Tobad, who gets the pass from Pada, excuse me. As they go back to Medellin for a reset. A timeout gonna be called by Nixon. 33-24, 6.47 left to play. You're watching Real Sports Live items, collectibles, and a selection of vinyl records that's as good as it gets. Every shelf, every aisle, and table is filled daily by a number of vendors that ensures that something here just might be the item you have to have. The vinyl record area helps bring an added atmosphere that makes for the fun trip when stepping back in time with the memories, forever memories, antiques and collectibles in San Benito. When excellence in academics meets discovery on the court, in the arts, with institutions of higher education and beyond. We That's a real sports live, 647 left to play. As Medellin is trying to drive, shake pass, Palmer gets the pass over to Tovar who makes a nice cut again. Tovar back to his wicked ways, 12 points on today. We've seen him make plenty of great plays like that. And something that King looks to suppress is a three by Kano for the answer. Nine points on today for Troy Cano. 35-29, or 27, excuse me. Blitzing through. And a three hit by Nixon. Swings it across. Trying to keep it in place. Johnson, Johnson goes around the baseline. Finds Cervantes from the elbow. And another three. Cervantes, four points on today. Medellin driving back, and we go back to an eight-point ball game, 550 left to play here. Take the way, looking to drive Cervantes, goes over Johnson, Johnson to put this one up off the glass, and he gets it through. Cut down to six. Nine points on today for John Michael Johnson, tied off with Troy Gano. Medellin driving this one back. Taking his time as he works his way down the court, swings it across now over to Garcia. He gets the pass from Garcia for a three. Won't go, that went a bit wide, so Ryan a jump ball. Goes to the King Mustangs. Again, fouls resetting. King finished off the first half with three fouls. Nixon with eight. That's Palmer driving this one back. Palmer going on the move. Swings it outward, gets it over. Johnson loses that one. Now one knocked out of the hands of Garcia. Palmer manages to keep up with the ball as he's trying to shake off Anaya. Swings it out over, putting it up, and a three won't go. Gets his own rebound, looking to cut through the rim. 
He puts this one up. That one rolls off the top of the backboard. Rebound here goes back over now to Medellin. Medellin goes off to Anaya. Anaya swings it back over now to Pada. Gilbert Pada again. 15 points on the day. Swings the pass off over. Back and forth passing. Finds Garcia for a three. Knocks it through. Back now here to a nine point game. Six points for Richard Garcia on the day. Already 241. Get the time corrected for y'all, ladies and gentlemen. 430 left to play. King basketball. Cervantes gets the inbound off to Johnson. Johnson goes back to Cervantes. Now we're seeing the press here by Nixon. And Cervantes is going to call his own number and drives this one off the glass. Six points on the day for Gabriel Cervantes. Get the pass to Pada. Goes to Anaya. Luis Anaya feeds the pass to Obani. He's going to be blocked here and shut down by Palmer, who tries to put it up as Anaya. Palmer on the rebound. And a foul drawn. And foul number one of the day. Number two of the day, excuse me. Foul number one for King as both teams have already committed one foul. Get that ball back. And bound off, we resume play. 34 41, seven point game. Gano swings it back across over, finds Johnson. Johnson goes back over to Gano. Call now. The Nixon Mustang basketball. Forty-one thirty-four. Let's get you a scoring update from gym number one. Here we have Ray taking on Miller in a great matchup here. Let's get you a scoring update in a few moments. Back underway. Naya goes off over. Solvada trying to drive through. Fakes the pass. Goes over to Bada. Bada goes back over to Garcia. Garcia now goes back to Solvada. Pump fakes on the shot. Goes back over now. Finds Salazar. Finds Naya. And goes back over to Garcia. Goes back to Bada. Who goes over to Salazar. Garcia cutting through. Gets the pass back over to Bada. At the top of the arc. Johnson quickly shaking, trying to shake it off. Kept in play by Tovado. Tippy toes his way on this side to avoid a backcourt call. Swings it over to Salazar. Salazar going on the move. Swings this one across now to Bada. Bada goes over to Anaya. It goes back to Tovar. Tovar is fouled. Foul number two here against Nixon. <laughs> Driving through, gets his pass across the fighter, goes to Anaya. Sobada goes back over to Salazar. Looking to maneuver around. Garcia caught in the press, gets the pass over to Bada. Bada. Not scored yet here in the third quarter. He's been suppressed defensively. As Johnson not letting him out of his side. He barely gets the pass off to Salazar. Gets this one outwards. Swings it out. Gets it over. The lot from downtown. Now and off the back of the rim. Won't go on the rebound. Johnson. Johnson on the drive back here. Running into three. Nixon defenders gets the pass back to Palmer. It goes back to Johnson who swings it back to Coleman who gets this one off to Gano for a three. Puts it through. Lead cut down to four off a three by Gano. 12 points on today. He now leads the scoring for the King Mustangs. Gets the pass across. Anaya swings it over to Tobar. Tobar tried his hand at a three. Goes off to Garcia who goes to Bada. Bada from downtown, puts it through for the response, and we go back to a seven-point game. 
18 points on the day for Gilbert Bada. Gano with the ball, swings it over. Goes to Cervantes, he goes to Palmer. Palmer looking to drive. Gets it over. Johnson from the baseline loses it. Anaya comes up with the steal. Anaya on the ball. Swings it back over. Bada from downtown off the back of the rim. Coleman on the rebound. Palmer driving this one back with a buck 12 left to play in this third quarter. Gets it across to be picked off and full extension there. Will Stobad who goes to Garcia, puts it up off and get through. Off the rim and it falls through. Eight points on today for Richard Garcia. Johnson swings it back over to Cervantes. Gabriel Cervantes, six points on today, nearly stolen away. Finds Palmer who pulls the trigger on the three. I'm gonna say Palmer stepped out of bounds as multiple check-ins. Looks like we have a full swap coming in. Inbound off, 46-37. As that gets the pass across, they're gonna drive through. Swings over, that one broken up by Palmer, winds up out of bounds. Thirty two seconds left to play in this third quarter. Long inbound throw here, gets it off to Escobar. Escobar goes over. Shoots it over to Medellin. Medellin scoreless in this one. Put up 15 in that game. Against CC Vets. As Nixon looks to go 2-0 against Corpus teams in this tournament. Swings it over. Alonzo. That's fouled. Alex Alonzo. It's foul number two now against King. Both teams with 2,000 in the second half. As Escobar set the inbound, three check-ins here set to come in as they get the inbound off. It's gonna go on the move here, that's Medellin. Medellin swings it back out, Alonzo from downtown, that one falls short. Winds up in control here and it's gonna be Mustang basketball, the King Mustangs. As Coleman set the inbound, this one Hunter Coleman. It's a long arcing throw, finds Cervantes who puts it up on a last second shot. That one won't go through. 46 37 year score as we head to the fourth quarter. You're watching Real Sports Live. Now, La Via ISD, Cardinal Pride. Service is attitude. How far are we willing to go to service our community, our dealership here at Fruya, and you? Sky's the limit. Plan your escape. Beach, bay, or both. Sun rises and sun sets daily. Memories made all day. Live music and great food round out your visit. So why wait? Sopadre.com. Welcome back to Real Sports Live, start of the fourth quarter, 46-37, Nixon leading King. Tournament coverage here on Real Sports Live. Of the Broward Classic coming to you from Kingsville High, Kingsville King High. Sending now by Big House Burgers here on 2209, Brahma Boulevard in Kingsville, Texas, as we're back underway. Medellin for a three, that one off the glass, won't go, gets his own rebound. That one thrown in the traffic, winds up out of bounds. It's going to be stolen back by Bada, goes over to Tobad, who gets this one across back over to Naya. Naya goes back over to Tobad. Ian Tobad was looking to cut through, now holds in his track, swings it back over to Bada, who goes to Garcia, who gets it off to Medellin. Medellin looking to go on the move, swings it back across over to Tobad. Tobad looking to cut, holds in his tracks again, and fires it off to Garcia, who goes back to Tobad, who makes a cut to the rim, won't go. On the rebound, Cervantes has that one knocked out of his hands and into the hands of Garcia. 
Anaya was looking to pull the trigger, but goes off to Garcia instead. It goes to Medellin, who goes over. Back to Anaya in the corner. Coleman drawing assignment on Anaya. And Garcia cuts through the rim and finds the open lane and puts it off the glass. 48-37. 10 points on today for Richard Garcia. Palmer driving back. Swings it outward. Gets it across to call the throne. Johnson from downtown. Off the back of the rim won't go. The wide with the rebound. Gets it across, shoots it out over to Medellin. Medellin on the drive back. Swings it off, cross now to Luis Anaya, who goes over to Bada. Bada maintaining control this one, swings it across with Olada. Olada going on the move, finds Garcia, cuts to the basket again. Two back-to-back -back plays where Richard Garcia cuts. Stealing a page out of Olada's playbook, 12 points on a day for Richard Garcia. And Garcia and Olada have both been making those nice cuts to the basket. And it'll be a steal here, a scholar on a sandwich between two defenders, gets this one across to Bada. Bada, step back, three from downtown, puts it through. Oh, 53-37, 21 points on today for Gilbert Bada. He was scoreless here, long since the second quarter, and tacked on one late in the third and one early on. A nice move there by Palmer, won't go. Anaya on the rebound, Anaya driving this one back for the Nixon Mustangs, going on the move. Bada was looking to go for a shot, and Tovada again cuts to the rim. In a timeout called, it's 14 points on today, for Tovada, 21 for Bada, and 12 for Garcia. Timeout called, Nixon leads 55-37, you're watching Real Sports Live. We envision that San Perlita ISD will help our students acquire the necessary knowledge, communication, and problem-solving skills through a variety of educational and social experiences to become productive citizens in our global society. Be a part of the change to help create a community where we guide each other to our unlimited potential. We are Santa Rosa and you're watching Real Sports Live. There is a feeling you get when you walk onto a campus. A sense of love, compassion, and dedication. An environment that inspires each of our HCISD family members to do their best and to be their best. We ground our education on strong character, and together, we will always persist towards the future. We are a district of choice. A district of innovation. And a district of excellence. We are HCISD. That's a Real Sports Live, 55-37. Nixon going on a 13-0 run. Swings it outwards. Talk about a 9-0 run here in the fourth quarter alone. Broken up. Stolen away by Escobar. Gets this one off to Leza. Leza off the glass, won't go. On the rebound, Levas. Gets it across now. Johnson looking to drive, puts it over and through, and that puts an end to the 13-0 run held by Nick Sinas. Johnson now with 11 points on the day. Enters the double digits himself. Ascano with 12, Palmer with 10, and Johnson here now with 11. Leza gets it across over to Alonso. Alex Alonso driving through, won't go. On the rebound, Gano. Swings it across. Johnson goes back over to Gano. Troy Gano now looking to go on the drive. Putting it up, won't go. On the rebound, Roman Livas tacks on his first bucket of the day. 41-55, 14 point game. Salazar goes over to Alonso. Alonso gets this one back across to Leza who gets this over now to Escobar. Escobar shoots it back out over to Medellin. He goes back over to Salazar. Salazar goes back over to Medellin. He gets it back over to Escobar. Escobar looking to go on the move here, being heavily contested. Feeds the pass off to Alonso. Gets this one off to Leza, who goes over to Medellin. Medellin swings it back over to Escobar. As King trying to keep up with the pass attack held by Nixon as they get the pass back to Escobar. Escobar was looking to cut in, but now goes around the arc. Goes back outside, looks to reset the offense. As he does, as he goes over to Alonso, who gets this one across to Medellin. 
Looking to go on the move, trying to hold off. King basketball. A five second call here now. That was called on Nixon. To driving this one back. Palmer caught in traffic between two defenders. Manages the break away. Palmer takes a spill. It's back up. Salazar for a three, that one falls short. John on the rebound, gets it across to Johnson. John Michael Johnson, 11 points on today. Now a two on one press, we're seeing it's Johnson gonna call his own number as that one knocked out of his hands. Medellin comes up with the ball, Medellin swings it over. Coming in was Leza who puts it through, and that's his first bucket of the day. A dominant run by Nixon again, 57-41. Looking to go on the move, swings it outwards. Palmer, catch and shoot, won't go. That one's just a bit short, missing the mark. Medellin on the rebound. Medellin driving it back, swings it out over, finds Lezo, puts it through, and it's fouled. It's foul number three against King, sends Lezo to the free throw line. Albert Lezo, two points on today. He's taking his first trip to the charity stripe. Puts it through. Three points on the day for Albert Leza. 58-41. Leza goes two for two. Four points on the day for him. 59-41. 2.16 left to play in the fourth. Swings it out, looking to drive through his Levi's. Has that one picked off now by Salazar. Salazar on the drive back. It's it off to Escobar, who has the open lane. And that one pinned here by Palmer. We're going down. We got to call that red. Looks like a goaltending call. It was ruled a block, though, by Palmer. We saw the layup going up and Palmer pinning it to the backboard. Take a look at the replay here. Palmer pinning that one on the backboard. Palmer now with the ball, swings it across to Coleman. Coleman looking to make a nice move, puts it up, won't go. Had a nice pivot, trying to get that one off the glass, just couldn't fall in. That one tipped up Mike Gunnell. Sixty-one forty-one. Going for a three, won't go on the rebound. My Johnson, John Michael Johnson gets the rebound. Now he's going to go on the move. Long three falls through. That's Gano who sails it in. 15 points on the day for Troy Gano. That's time continuing to wind down. 61 44. 17 point lead here by the Nixon Mustangs. And a very dominant outing. Two great outings. As a scoring update here, Miller leads Ray by 10 with 142 left to play in the ball game. Miller leading Ray by 10, 53-43. Now a pass around the perimeter here, looking to play keep away. As the final 38 seconds begin to wind down, shots at the basket won't go. Palmer gets it off over Calderon and it's blocked here by Escobar. And 53-44, now a nine-point lead as Miller continues to lead Ray. 
108 left and a timeout being called and that one over in gym number one. Coming up next, Kingsville h &M Kings set to take on Ingleside in our last game of day one of the Brahma Classic. Looking to drive through, putting it up, get on the rebound, swings it over to the cross. Leza swings it over and a foul called. Foul number four against King. Let's go, Tito. Escobar, and that's his first free throw. That's his first point of the day. 18 point game. And they'll make it a 19 point game as Escobar goes two for two from the free throw line. 63-44. Swings it out. Pulling the trigger on a shot. Gets it through. That's Eli Sanchez. It's a deep three. 7-63, 16-point ball game. That'll do it. Nixon goes 2-0 on the day. 2-0 against Corpus Christi team. Wins at 63-47. Final recap after this. You're watching Real Sports Live and beyond. We are the future leaders, and our success starts now. La Via ISD, Cardinal Pride. We're the Red Texans, and you're watching Rich Sports Live. Josh Moody and Coach Rolly Gonzalez of Josh Moody Loans are former Harlingen Cardinals and would like to wish all the teams good luck in tonight's games. Vision that San Perlita ISD will help our students acquire the necessary knowledge, communication, and problem solving skills through a variety of educational and social experiences to become productive citizens in our global society. Be a part of the change to help create a community where we guide each other to our unlimited potential. We are Santa Rosa and you're watching Real Sports Live. There is a feeling you get when you walk onto a campus. A sense of love, compassion, and dedication. An environment that inspires each of our HCISD family members to do their best and to be their best. We ground our education on strong care. Back to Real Sports Live, your post-game wrap-up wrap here presented by Luke Freer Motors, San Mito EDC. Luke Freer Motors, Rolly Gonzalez, Josh Moody Loans, and visit SouthPodreIsland.com. 63-47, your final score. Nixon knocks off Corpus Christi King. Nixon Mustangs go 2-0 against Corpus teams after also knocking off Corpus Christi Vets, 76-49. Let's give you the rundown here in the first half. King finished off with three fouls. They finished off with four in the second quarter. Combined seven on the day. For Nixon, they finished off with eight in the first half. Two in the second, combined ten between the day. On the scoring here for King, Troy Gano finished off with 15 points, leading the scoring. Terrell Palmer with 10. John Michael Johnson with 11. Roman Rivas with 2. Eli Sanchez with 3. Gabriel Cervantes with 6. Make it 47 for the King Mustangs. Over for Nixon, Alex Alonso finished off with 5 points. Richard Garcia, 12. Jose Escobar finished off with 2. Albert Leza with 4. Gilbert Pada with 21. And Ian Tolado with 14. What a day from day one. We had some great matchups here. We had a Great one between Cal Allen. Between Cal Allen and SGA girls basketball. Cal Allen winning that one 43-23 then. Corpus Christi veterans knocks up Corpus Christi King. And a close one at first. And then veterans explosive defense out of nowhere. The win is 68-38. Game three, we had Nixon knock off Corpus Christi veterans 76-49. And then we have Corpus Christi King knocking off or knocked off by Nixon, 63-47. More recap after this, you're watching Real Sports Live. I love what I do. I, I really do. I love what do. I'm doing. I love children. One of the most important things to do is to love your students. Imagine teachers like these helping your child prepare to change the world. Take a closer look at Mission CISD. Back to Real Sports Live, your post-game wrap-up again, 63-47, your final score, pool play. Already wrapping up in Gen 2. Gym number one, one more game. English Lions have to take on Kingsville King. That's going to do it for us here from Gym 2 on day one of the 2021 Brahma Classic here from H&M King High School in Kingsville, Texas. 
great day of basketball here played in day one. Not over as we have gym number one with our last game set to tip off in a few moments. Let's again, I'd like to thank our sponsor here. It's tournament sponsor, Big House Burgers, 2209 Brahma Boulevard in Kingsville, Texas. Go by after the game for some burgers, barbecue, wings, and sandwiches, and a few favorites of your adult beverages. We also do they also do catering for special events again. Big House Burgers on 2209 Brahma Boulevard in Kingsville. That's going to do for us here from day two. From day one, Jim Two. Signing out for now for Kevin Naro, Joe Bowling, from my cameraman, Rudy Zamaripa, and from Real Sports Live. I'm Ruben Rodriguez saying so long and good night. From HM King, Jim Two. We'll see you next time.